number two. Live odds, bet online, Panthers, Jags, pick 43 and a half the total. We have a quarterback battle here, and it's not pretty. Some have suggested that the Jacksonville quarterback isn't even on the roster right now. Uh, I'm surprised the Jags haven't cut Bortles. If he gets hurt, if he suffers a season-ending injury, they got to pay him $18 million next year. That becomes guaranteed. Booted home in the last preseason game against Tampa. It was a horror show. They have scored three points in six possessions with Bortles on the field. Henny didn't do much either. So Marone won't commit or will even start this game. I haven't talked to the quarterbacks yet. I just want to see how the practices go. Both of them are doing fine. I want to get all the info and make sure I'm comfortable with the direction I'm going and doing what's best for the team. You know, you, you saw so many professionals on this win total over. I mean, it could be a long year for Jacksonville again, considering they went 3-13 and 13 and don't have a quarterback. Yeah, it's been a disaster for the Jags at the quarterback position so far here in the preseason. It's not like Chad Henney has played great. Is that Blake Bortles had played that bad. But I'm one of the guys that you talk about with a Jaguars over ticket in my pocket. Oh. Assuming they get mediocre QB play and not disastrous QB play. This team is good enough to win seven or more games this year. But <laughs> when it comes to what type of QB play they're going to get here. Look, it's not going to help. You know, Leonard Fournette's not going to play this ballgame. Marquis Lee is not going to play. TJ Yeldon is uh, sitting out again. You know, it's a relatively thin running back rotation. You've got Chris Ivory, Corey Grant, uh, Duwan Harris uh, in that RB rotation. So they're not going to hand the ball off 100 times uh, in this contest. And it's a situation where Marone is splitting reps. You know, both potential starters, Henny and Bortles, are getting 50% of the reps with the first team. And Marone hasn't even said who's going to start for this contest. So the QB situation in Jacksonville Clearly problematic right now. That being said, whoever comes in and plays backup will have opportunities as a, a quarterback with starting experience against reserve defenders. And maybe Newton sees his first action of the preseason. Rivera said he is trending up, but will his presence move the needle? Will do anything because Carolina has 27 points and 386 yards in the loss to Tennessee and 27 points and 388 in the win over Houston. Anderson and Webb, a pretty good, uh, pretty good backup and quarterback rotation behind Newton. Well, Anderson was throwing picks last week, and that's a danger uh, that you have with uh, Derek Anderson. Certainly cost a Panthers backers early in the game against Tennessee. But you wonder if Anderson and Webb, because these are guys that are in rhythm right now, Newton's going to be rusty if he plays in this ballgame. You can count on money showing for Carolina if Cam Newton's going to be in the lineup. That might be money worth fading. Anderson and Webb in rhythm might actually better for be better for a preseason first half uh, than uh, a rusty uh, Cam Newton. Ron Rivera, quote, you know, talking about whether Newton's going to play. This is just a little microcosm of it because you can't simulate the game speed. And the biggest thing really is getting them all out there. And hopefully we can get them all out there. Rivera hasn't said Cam Newton's going to play. All we have is this quote as of now. But it's certainly, you know, <laughs> the, calling his status trending up for playing is very possible. We'll see Cam Newton in this ballgame. If we do, expect a significant line move. If you want to get out ahead of it, you may want to get on Carolina now rather than later. Hey, guys, for the full video, go to sbrpicks.com. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos, so please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now not to mention a visit to our industry-leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.